Hey, what's up, Sun Bitcoin fam? It's Dale back again, and today we've got some seriously exciting news for all the stargazers and space enthusiasts out there. We're talking about a once-in-a-lifetime cosmic event happening right now, so grab your telescopes and let's dive in. So imagine this. Any day now, a super rare, bright new star will light up the night sky. I'm talking about a star so bright it's going to rival Polaris, the North Star. And the best part? You don't need any fancy equipment to see it, just your eyes. The star in question? T. Corone Borealis, or as its friends call it, T. Corbor. It's a white dwarf star chilling 3,000 light years away from Earth in the Corona Borealis constellation, which is kind of like its own cosmic neighborhood. But here's the catch, this star is actually dead. Yeah, you heard me right. It died a long time ago, but now it's coming back to life with a massive explosion that will make it shine super bright for a short time. It last exploded about 80 years ago, so this is like witnessing history in the making. Alright, so how is a dead star coming back to life, you ask? T core bore is what we call a recurrent nova, meaning it explodes, calms down, and then explodes again. And this time it's going to be spectacular. Here's the science behind it. T core bore is a white dwarf, but it's hanging out really close to a red giant star. The white dwarf has been feasting on material from the red giant like a cosmic vacuum cleaner. Now all that material is building up, and it's about to blow up in a huge explosion known as a nova. In fact, astronomers have already spotted some signs of this coming explosion. The star's brightness has dipped, which is exactly what happened just before its last explosion back in 1946. So they're like, yup, it's gonna blow. Now for all the science nerds in the house, this event is huge. Astronomers around the world are gearing up for this with a ton of fancy equipment, both in space and on the ground. They'll be using everything from NASA's Fermi Gamma Ray Space Telescope to the James Webb Space Telescope to study this nova up close and personal. Why? Well, novas are still kind of a mystery. We don't fully understand the details of how these explosions work, but studying T-Core Bohr will give scientists a front row seat to see the whole thing unfold. One of the coolest things they're watching for is how fast the material from the white dwarf gets blown away after the explosion. They'll also be looking at how the shock waves from the blast travel through space. Imagine cosmic ripples flying through the universe. Now this is where it gets even better for you. t Bohr is going to be visible to the naked eye for a few days right after the explosion. So grab a blanket, head outside, and look up to witness this cosmic fireworks show. But don't worry if you miss it because gamma ray and x-ray telescopes will keep watching it for months. And radio telescopes will be studying the aftermath for years. So, this explosion will keep giving scientists data long after we've seen it. Now, I know what you're thinking. Dale, should I be worried about this giant explosion? The answer is no. This thing is far enough away that it's not going to hurt us. You can just sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. To put it simply, this is one of those rare cosmic events that's truly once in a lifetime. Not only will it be breathtaking to see, but it's also going to help scientists learn more about the life and death of stars, which could change how we understand the universe itself. Alright Sun Bitcoin fam, that's it for today's video! Are you excited to catch this cosmic explosion? Let me know in the comments below! Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit that bell icon so you don't miss out on any more epic space content. Thanks for watching, and as always, keep looking up at the stars. Also remember, peace out.